If you hold a Deadeye for its entire duration, the maximum amount of damage you can deal is 1554.80. Against a target with high HP, like Symmetra's ultimate, this damage isn't enough to destroy it. Not even close. But what if I told you you can destroy it, and what if all it takes is a little finesse? Okay, the spinning is unnecessary, but it's true. A little bit of camera manipulation causes Deadeye to do more damage. Why? Deadeye deals damage using an accumulation system. Once a target is locked onto, the damage done to that target increases at a rate of 130 per second. After 2 seconds, this rate is doubled to 260 damage per second. Ordinarily, that's all there is to it. But there's a problem. Remember how the damage rate is doubled at the 2 second mark? It turns out uh -huh. this damage doubling function can be re-triggered multiple times by breaking and re-establishing line of sight. This causes the damage to increase exponentially, far exceeding what should be the maximum amount. Interestingly, there is a damage cap. Is there a beeping in this video? That I can only charge up to 99,900. There's like a very, very, very light beeping. I thought my, I thought my apartment was on fire. It sounded like the fire alarm from the building over. I was like, wait, what the fuck am I listening to? 199 damage. Holy sh! This damage doubling quirk can be triggered in two ways: having your target jiggle peek behind a cover. or by intentionally moving your camera. Both oh my God. cause line of sight to be broken and remade, allowing for a faster kill. This is made evident by the skull icon, which appears when your accumulated damage exceeds the target's current health. Hi, Future Marbler here. While editing this video, I found another Deadeye bug. I know, unbelievable. This ring indicator is supposed to display how much damage you have built up, but it isn't very accurate. As shown here, I kill Ball without having a skull icon. For some reason, the presence of armor HP really con- You on cameo. Fog. P really confuses the indicator. It takes much longer to build a skull than it should, but only visually. The damage is still enough Holy to get a kill, sh just doesn't show it. So, uh, yeah, don't trust the indicator against armored targets. Okay, bye. Since your camera can influence this, it's useful to know what counts as being in view. Deadeye has a 105 degree field of view, irrespective of your FOV settings in the options menu. Its shape is effectively a cone, which covers this region of the screen at the maximum FOV setting. You can't lock onto players on the sides of your screen, but you can lock onto players pretty far above and below your screen. What? It's fine. Blizzard is a very small indie company. Knowing the exact sure extent of the lock-on FOV, we can hey, task a perfect Love dead eye by hitting the damage unity. He's not appreciated. Damage cap in 2.93 seconds. What? Knowing the exact extents of the lock-on FOV, we can tass a perfect Deadeye by hitting the damage cap in 2.93 seconds. Now before you get too excited, there are some caveats to this technique. Damage doubling is only possible after the first damage increase occurs at the 2 second mark. By this point, Deadeye has already charged 260 damage, which is enough to kill most heroes anyway. Deadeye also yeah, accumulates take... damage separately per target, so you can't farm a bunch of damage on one player, then transfer it to another. Still, this is a pretty interesting quirk that might make Deadeye a pretty decent ultimate. Assuming the bullet, you know, hits. <laughs> <laughs> no way, dude! Oh my god. Holy sh**. Dude, that's terrifying. Super did in the game? Oh no. I did see like a Twitter post of 
like not my streamer bug abusing or some Dude, don't tell me not my streamer abusing abusing a bug Okay, okay, just take me, take me, take me, take me, take me. Oh my god! <laughs> he deleted him! Wait a minute! Was he blocking? Was he blocking? Blocking? Oh, he stopped blocking. Either way, though, it shouldn't have killed him. Wow, not my streamer. Not my streamer bug abusing. <laughs> That's at wait. Actually, I think he still would have died even if he was blocking, though, to be honest. But wow, holy sh. That's insane. That's actually insane. Can you try it? I guess I could do it in the practice range. They don't have they don't have their full HP. They don't have their full HP. It's uh okay. There's a workshop code I created to prac I made to practice it. Do you do you got it? Press R to tasks. 99 times damage. Well, F's changing. It's half past six. Wait, what? What was that? Yeah. It's two in the morning. I don't think I need to do it. I think it's out of. It's past your bedtime. Oh. It's past your bedtime. <laughs> oh my god. It's half past six. Oh. Holy. Your team has taken the lead. Those who don't know, who don't can understand what's happening, I will just charge it regularly. Six. I didn't I didn't do anything. Oh my god. It's half past six. Aha, killing time. Hey, that is unbelievable. That's insane. Press tab? I didn't press tab. It's half past six. It's past your bedtime. It's half past six. It's past your bedtime. Wow, you can go above a million. Oh, how do you think it goes? It'd probably take a while. But you probably get pretty high, right? I got a I got a super clickbait TikTok last night when I was just at night doing nothing. Overwatch TikTok. And this guy was like, I got 64 limbs in this game, 23,000 damage and lost. And the game was on Havana first. They full held them and then had a lever and ended up losing because they played 4v5 on the first point Havana and like they just didn't push the cart and lost. It was like a silver game, you could tell. And I was like, there's not a chance in hell you got 62 limbs that game. Like there's, there's actually no chance. The game wasn't long enough. And I was like, damn, like, people doing clickbait TikToks at this point. That was cool, though. That was cool.